Hello and welcome to our YouTube channel, Learn One More. Today we will look into the fascinating life of one of Pakistan's most iconic figures, Imran Ahmed Khan Niazi. From his legendary cricket career to his transformative journey in politics, Imran Khan's story is one of resilience, leadership and passion. Join us as we uncover the top 10 facts about this remarkable individual who has left an undeniable mark on the world stage. Let's go! Khan was born in Lahore on 5th October 1952. He is the only son of Ikramullah Khan Niazi, a civil engineer, and his wife Shokat Khanum. He has four sisters and has long settled in Mia Valley in northern western Punjab. His paternal family are one of Pashtun descent and belong to the Niazi tribe. Khan's maternal family has produced several cricketers, including those who have represented Pakistan, such as his cousin Javed Burki and Majid Khan. Following a populist campaign against corruption in the 2018 elections, Imran Khan became the 22nd Prime Minister of Pakistan on the 17th of August 2018. Khan's government launched an anti-corruption campaign, improved security and banned certain extremist groups. In social policy, he reformed education and healthcare and expanded large welfare programs most prominently the Sehet Sahulat program. His government passed the Zainab Alert Bill as an attempt to increase women's rights in Pakistan. His environmental initiatives, primarily the plant for Pakistan, increased renewable energy and attempted to reforest Pakistan at a large scale. If they were to progress, they must win this match. Head. Okay. Head. Fly that. <laughs> uh, we'll pass. Okay. Good luck. Yeah. Good luck. Yeah. All the best. Imran, I thought you were the line of law. What's this? Well, uh, this is what I've been telling Alan that I want my team to play today like a cornered tiger, you know, when it's at its most dangerous. <laughs> the 1992 Cricket World Cup witnessed a remarkable victory by Pakistan under the leadership of Imran Khan. Imran, as the captain, inspired his team to overcome numerous challenges and emerged victorious in the tournament. Despite facing setbacks early on, Pakistan's journey in the World Cup was nothing short of miraculous. Beyond his achievement in cricket, is renowned for his selfless charity work in Pakistan. One of the most notable contributions is the establishment of Shokat Hanum Memorial Cancer Hospital and Research Centre. Founded in memory of his mother, the hospital provides state-of-the-art cancer treatment to thousands of patients regardless of their ability to pay. Imran Khan's dedication to this cause has significantly impacted the lives of many individuals and families affected by cancer. Imran Khan's educational journey at Oxford University in Etchison College played a significant role in shaping his future endeavours. Imran Khan pursued his higher education at Oxford, where he studied philosophy, politics and economics. This academic experience not only honed his critical thinking skills, but also broadened his perspective on global issues and governance. Khan is also an accomplished author. He has penned several books that reflect his diverse interests and experiences. One of his notable works is Pakistan, A Personal History, where he delves into the political landscape of Pakistan and shares insights into his own journey in the country's tumultuous history. In 1996, Imran Khan won a contentious libel case in the London courts. After former England stars Ian Botham and Alan Lamb accused him of calling them uneducated racists in course of an interview granted to India Today journalist Shekhar Gupta. The 13-day trial ended with the jury taking just under four hours to reach a verdict in a trial that stirred up traditional British preoccupations with class and race. Botham and Lamb were liable to pay court costs amounting to an estimated £500,000. On 
the 3rd November 2022, Imran Khan was shot in an attempted assassination in Vazirabad, Punjab during a march against the Pakistan government. The gunman also injured a number of other people and killed a supporter. Khan was shot in the shin and thigh on the right leg and was transferred to a hospital in Lahore where he underwent treatment. During his cricketing days, Khan featured in many advertisements and television commercials as a celebrity brand endorser. These included Pepsi Pakistan, Brook Bond, Thumbs Up and the Indian soap brand Synthol. And finally, let's not forget Imran's remarkable contributions to the sport of cricket. He led Pakistan to its first and only Cricket World Cup victory in 1992, a defining moment in the nation's cricketing history. Over his illustrious career, Khan amassed over 3,800 runs and took 362 wickets in Test cricket, making him one of the finest all-rounders of his time. He was known for his exceptional leadership, strategic acumen and ability to inspire his teammates. Imran Khan's legacy transcends the boundaries of cricket, elevating him to the status of a true hero in the hearts of many. His remarkable journey from a cricketing icon to a philanthropic trailblazer showcases the depth of his character and the breadth of his impact. Imran Khan's story is not just one of sporting triumphs, but a saga of compassion, resilience and unwavering determination to make the world a better place.